What's up guys, I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan Battle video. So a brand new Purunga campaign is on its way to global, which means there will be 3 more sets of 7 Dragon Balls for us to collect. Now courtesy of French data miner Kawai on Twitter, I can now present you with all the information you need to collect all 7 Dragon Balls for your first set of wishes. Now, there seemed to be a lot of confusion on the video that I made regarding the Purunga Dragon Balls during the 3 year anniversary on Global, so before we move any further, I want to make a couple things very, very clear. Number 1, today, August 21st, 2018, the day that the video is being released, the Dragon Balls are not yet available. The campaign will start tomorrow on August 22nd, 2018, which is the day after the video is being released, and number 2, Starting tomorrow, you will be able to collect one new Dragon Ball per day in the order that I present them in this video. So for example, tomorrow, August 22nd, 2018, you can collect Set 1, Ball 1, and the day after, August 23rd, 2018, you will be able to collect Ball 2, and on the day after, August 24th, 2018, you can collect Ball 3, and so on and so forth until all 7 Dragon Balls for Set 1 are complete. You can make your wishes and then set 2 will start, and then after that is set 3, and same thing with those sets, it's 1 ball per day for a total of 21 balls over 21 days. So if you can't collect a certain ball that I'm talking about in any of these videos, don't worry, it probably means that it's not available yet, and if you are confused by anything I said in the video, or you think that you're doing something wrong, just leave a comment down below, and I will try my best to help you out. One last thing I wanted to mention before we got started, is that if you missed balls in between, you can still collect all of them retroactively, but if a ball hasn't been released yet, then you cannot collect it. So with all of that out of the way, let's get into how you can collect all 7 Dragon Balls for your first set of new Purunga Wishes. Starting with the first ball, and for this one, all you have to do is use a training location. So let's say you want to train the new Great Saiyaman 1 and 2. All you have to do is go select the training location. I don't believe Wasteland works, but anything else will work. Korin's Tower. Kami's Lookout, Snake Way, Gravity Chamber, whatever you want, train up the character and you will get your first Dragon Ball. Now for ball number 2, you have to go to the Baba Shop, and once it loads, come on, load, buy something with Baba Points. So let's go down here, let's say I want to buy these training items, sure, why not, I can never have enough training items. There we go, I bought the item with Baba Points and I will get my second ball once it's available. Now. For ball number 3, you have to go to the home screen and hit the button to change from quest to event 5 times. So just go like this, boom, and hit that 5 times and you will get your third Dragon Ball for set 1. Now for ball number 4, just go to summon and you will have to do a friend summon. So I'm actually going to do one right now because I still need more dupes, a lot more dupes of the new LR Saiyaman. So let's do friend summon, maybe we can get some of that luck. You know, share some of that luck in this video, and you guys can help me pull an LR right here, right now. Let's pull down, we got Rainbow, Super Saiyan, that's a promising sign. It's gonna become kind of a, a mini summoning video, I guess. Here we go, Super Saiyan 2. Looks promising so far. Pui Pui. Just gonna click through these real quick, Cell Junior. Pui, a pool. Oh, look at that! We pulled the freaking LR on this video. That's not even a summoning video. <laughs> that's freaking awesome. So. Uh, that's actually the second copy I have now, and we got some Zenny too. So I'm gonna feed that into my one copy of Saiyan Man, so we can get him to, or him and her, them to SA2. And I just need what, like 12 more copies for the do pads and SA and all that stuff. Anyways, that is your fourth Dragon Ball. Now for ball number five, all you have to do is use a Senzu Bean. Now I'm gonna show you guys, you know, how to do that. I think it's pretty self-explanatory. But for newer players, I guess if you don't know what that is. Go to items, uh, support items, and the item you want to use is this right here, a Senzu Bean that heals you up all the way. So just take that item into an event, use it, and you will get your fifth Dragon Ball when the event is over. Now for Dragon Ball number six, you have to awaken a character with a Grand Elder Guru. So let's go back to Awakening Medals, and Grand Elder Guru is just this coin or this medal right here so awaken any character that uses the grand elder guru medal and you will get your sixth dragon ball and for the last dragon ball of set one all you have to do is clear a stage i think any stage works story stage um event stage whatever dokkan event with a piccolo on your team so any character with the exact name piccolo should work 
Let's go to our character list. Let's see what we have in terms of Piccolos. Um, I'm pretty sure the LR Piccolo is just called Piccolo. So if we go to attack, this Piccolo right here, he's just called Piccolo. So if you use the LR Piccolo, that will work just fine. But the Strike Piccolo works too. And I believe that the new Piccolo that we're getting um, as a login bonus when the 250 million download celebration starts can also work for this specific um, for this purpose. So there you go. There you have it. Those are all seven Dragon Balls for your first set of new Purunga Wishes on Global. If you follow all the steps, do it one per day starting tomorrow on August 22nd, 2018. You will be able to make your first set of Purunga Wishes by the end of it. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Once we get more information about the second set and third sets, like second, second and third, I will make another video bring you guys that information and we can all make the wishes together as well. So that's going to do it for the video. Hope you guys found it useful. If you have any questions, like I said, leave it in the comments and I will try my best to help you out. But if you guys like today's video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel and you like what you see, then maybe, just maybe, hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. But always, as always, hope you guys have a fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Mia, signing out.